Hello everyone, it is the 3rd of May of 2023 and I'm going to have my second draft of the day. Now, uh, I said before that I was going to try and space these out, but as it turns out, I just really enjoy drafting that I end up having like a load of games early in a set, like when the quick draft becomes available and then when the set comes around the second time I just sort of like ignore it and say like right I'm done with the set. Which I suppose is an alright way of going about it actually, it's not like such a, a great idea. I suppose it's like I'm, I've got that phase where it's like I'm in the mood for the, the thing. Um, but also the last one that I did, I messed up the recording in this. I actually didn't record the drafting process. I only got the game. So this time I've got it. I can see I've got it recording. I can see the little thing there. The strange thing as well is that I did actually do that thing where I changed the thing to, uh, you know, change the view to turn all the card styles off and all that. And I didn't even notice that it wasn't recording. It was only when the first game started that I actually noticed but anyway I went 1-3 well, I've actually started off on a good streak with the set and it's starting to win and I, d I don't want this to be like a you know like a oh I've got to I've got to end this on a win type of deal but um, I mean I am definitely picking the rare anyway but when it enters battlefield create x22 white and blue night tokens with vigilance I mean okay if, if, let, let's not even look at that other side yet. Let's let's uh, right back at one vision. You're a knight. Let's let's see if this thing can tempt me towards the knight deck. Let's see if I can actually like do it. But as it stands so far, I'm taking that one. Even if I can't get knights, um, I can get some some good stuff going on. Anyway, that's a. Uh, you know what? There, you're a knight. Uh, I'll take you. All right then. What do I have here? Um. I mean, you're good anyway. Some more removal stuff going on there. Yes. When it is the Bifold tap tag artifact that which opponent controls a plus tongue counter on it. Whenever it deals combat damage to a battle or player draw a card, do I have Oh well you're a Phyrexian knight. So I'm actually like now I'm hunting. I'm hunting for Oh, what are you? Oh, whenever you cast it into a sorcery spell, you may tap two and tap creatures you control if you do. So I'm gonna okay. So I'm looking for preening champion. I'm looking for anything that requires like knights. Oh, as long as you control the knight, that that that's a knight. When it when it enters the battlefield, tap target which controls. If you yeah, if you control another knight. Oh, nice. Convoke Knight. Yep. And you're sort of like incubate. I'll take you. Uh, hold on. What are you? I'll put you into the sideboard. I'll take you. Yeah, I'll put you into the sideboard again. See, I'm feeling with this deck, it's sort of like... I, uh, I'm not going to use you, but just take you because I don't have a full place ahead of you. Planes. Right. Oh, it enters the battlefield reveal the number of dragons. Yep. Um, I mean, it is a mythic, so I'll take it. Phyrexian Knight. My permit you control transforms into a Phyrexian, put a 1 1 counter on it. Um, What are you? Where is the battlefield? Create a 2 2 white and blue knight token with vigilance? Yes! I think. Oh, I didn't see what the top one was. I didn't look. Well, that's a land that works well. Let's have a look at the other things I've got going on here. 
Uh, oh, well, you're a, you're a knight. You're a big... You're a, a rare knight. Oh, you've got Convoke. Man. I am a... Uh, Certainly piling up on these knights. Incubate for whenever permanent your control transforms or permanent into the battlefield under your control transforms. You may draw a card if you, you may draw a card if you do. Uh, I'll put you in the sideboard. Hold on, what are you? Alright. Um Yeah, I think I'll take you. You're a knight with double strike. Yeah. I'm I'm really going all out with these knights. Oh, I think I'll take you because you're knight dependent. I'll take the battle. Got another knight, more knightage going on there. Maybe I'm overdoing it. Even if, if I'm not, even well, even if I am, it's going to be fun regardless. Human knight creatures you control with first strike have double strike. I, I don't actually know if any of these things do have first strike, but I'll I'll take it and see if I do have anything with first strike. Uh, well, I won't be using black, but put you in into sideboard. I'll take you, maybe not use you, but we'll see. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure about that one, but I'll take it, whatever. Right. And my rare. Get. Oh, well. I suspect I won't use that one. I'll stick it in the sideboard for now. But we'll see. I've not actually used this one at all. Get another one of you, maybe. Hold on, one of you. Yep. Okay. Um. As a battlefield draw again, fall life and draw a card, flying vigilance. An angel. All right. Here I have. I do like infected defector. Whenever you cast a spell, the targets one or more permanent incubate too. I don't think I've got much that targets. Ah, oh, I suppose. Yeah, I can take you. God, I would love that blue white knight about now. I would, that that blue white knight that taps. We'll take Seraph of, of New Capenna. I'll put you on the sideboard, I think. Uh, I don't know what scroll shift. Uh, temporal cleansing. I've not actually used that, I don't think. Another one of you, maybe. Go on. 
I don't want to use three of you, but such might be the way of things. I'll take the halberd. I've got nothing on the one drop slot. I don't want too many of those. Well, I don't know. I'll have to see what I've got. Uh, potentially, I'll stick you in just in case. Actually, I tell you what, I will put you in the sideboard just because I'm currently focusing on on a on like knights and all that. But that's all right. I don't actually have that. If I had that um that blue white one that did something with knights, that would uh, be a real help. But I'm going to actually do a search for night. Oh, hold on. For night. Jeez. <laughs> this is a night deck. So let's see how many of these. So you don't depend on knights. Um, Printing champion would be nice. Number of creatures you control. Yep, you depend on knights. You don't depend on knights, but you are a knight. You are a knight. Double strike. Creatures you have with first strike. You know what? I don't think any, but I will search first strike. Yeah, it is just you. So. Um. When you look to the top six cards of your library, you may choose two creature cards. Many of your excellence are among them, where X is the number of creatures you control that convoke this thing. Um. Put the real card as you hide in the shovel. So you require what is there anything that requires Is that the only one that requires knights? I guess it's just that one. Which I suppose three I suppose three of those would work well in that case, if that's the only thing that requires knights. Um although what do I have here? Okay, so I need to take four cards out, but I do think I will keep all three of those in. Um, when you can spell the tag, it's one of more permanents. Incubate two. There was something else, wasn't there? That um, where is it? Do I even have it? Maybe it's in my sideboard. No. Right. Well, this should be fun. But yeah, definitely keeping all three of those in. I'll take you out. I think I'll take you out as well. I've got two of those battles. Um Right, let's take two cards out. Should I take one stasis field out? Or what do you do? Do I target non-token artifact or enchantment and opponent controls incubate two or incubate two and then just get it for free? Might take you out. Yeah. I'm not sure what this creature, creature gets plus one plus one and has flying. That seems alright.
So do I really want that many battles? I definitely want you. Tell you what, I'll take one of that one out. So okay, I mean this is a potentially interesting deck. Let's hope I win more than one. See, it's dark in my room right now because I've got the curtains closed. Um. Oh. I'll take the risk. Oh. Okay. Well, that kind of worked out, I guess. And I can transform that next turn, which... Oh, oh they're not doing anything. Right. I know it makes it a bit of a removal magnet. So you have Convoke. Right. Could do with another land about now. Don't fancy bringing you up with Rex equal one. <laughs> for X equals one, not for Rexia one. Oh no! Oh no! When it enters the battlefield, return up to one target creature to its owner's hand. Uh. I quite like that, if I'm honest. Do, do, do. Oh, this is nice. I can bring you out and, and stun something. Potentially. All right. All right. That's not nice. Yes. Oh yeah, the minus one, minus one effect. Didn't need it, but still. See, I can use that. Oh, I can use that. And have X equals three to get three knights. And then use this. At a high cost. But it's been the theme for the past few drafts. The past couple drafts where I have a... I've won... Um, uh, huh. Right, okay. So you to you. Because if anything blocks that, it will just die. I, I mean, I'll probably still successfully block though. Yeah. Let's bring you out with X equal four. Ooh, look at all those knights. Right, 
Well, that's a big thing in the air. And there are Vigilance as well. Right. Yeah, I wanted to make sure that that got through. Right. Okay. You're in for a bad time. So I think I think that's gonna die next turn anyway. So, uh, hold on. Un untap. Tap X tap creatures you control when you do shuffle target non land permanent and opponent controls when you make XLS into its owner's library. You know what? I think I'd rather get that emblem. Finally, we have the edge. Oh. Yeah, go on, they're in the air anyway. So what is it? You look at the top, top six cards of your library. You may reveal two creature cards with the value of X or less. So if where X is the number of creatures you convoked, put the real card into your hand and shuffle. Ah, okay. Yeah, let's do it for three. Right. Okay then. So Teferi's gonna die. But I'll have a lot to get in with. Don't worry. Right. Thing is, they've got stuff going on in the air. But you will be a thing in the air as well. No, shall I just send my knights that way? No. Huh. Well, they've all got vigilance. I could send them all towards the enemy directly and then just bring you out. I think that's my. Oh. It's, it's a challenge. It's a real challenge. Ah, so you'll get minus one, minus one. Nice. Oh, well, I won. Ooh, that was very good. That was excellent, in fact. I don't like how dark it is, but I don't want to move. <laughs> it's very dark in here, because the sun is like... It's behind clouds, so it's not it's not sunny. But it like it was sunny, so I closed the curtains. And now it's at the time where it's dark in here because I have the curtains closed. Hmm. No, I'm mulligan this. Right. I think I'll get rid of you. Yeah, it's dark here because the curtains are closed, but if I had the curtains open, it wouldn't be dark. And I, it's like, I don't have the lamp on because it was light before, so I'm now sitting the sitting in the dark, whereas like, if I just opened up the curtains... Um, I wouldn't be. 
But hey, if they transform that, which they're not. Uh, still. No. Well, that's awkward. I mean, we'll see what they do. I've got two, two ways of dealing with whatever they do. Ah. That really doesn't help. I can return the knight to their hand and just kill the knight. Or I can bring you out. I mean, yeah, you're stronger than. Yeah, I mean, it's not going to make any difference, is it? Because it's not going to get a stun counter because I don't have any of the knights, which is the whole point of that thing. Right. But if they transform it, I can bounce it. But they're not. I don't want to bounce the token maker, Knight of the New Coalition. Because then they'll just get another knight. Uh, no, I'll kill you. I mean, they'll probably do something. Angelic intervention or something. Alright. Okay, well, it survives at least. Um, your sorcery, your enchantment. So I have to do. Mm, no, I'll do this. Get some convoke out of you. At least this way I get a flyer. That is unless they counter it, of course, which they might. No, they don't. What does this, what does this uh, set have in terms of counter spells? I know it's got negate. It's got negate. I don't think it's got much else. I don't know. Right, come on. Transform your guy, please. I'd like that. Oh no! Jeez, I could have used some of those in my deck. Right. Well, once again, they've probably, they've probably got something going on that's going to block that out. It's going to really... Ah, uh, yeah. Well, at least theirs dies. Right. I would like to angelic intervention. Right. Um I think right. Oh, there's nothing X or less. Right. Okay. Yeah, that was Oh, I think that was a bad move. I don't think I've got anything that's only one mana. Didn't think, 
did not think. But I can potentially give it vigilance. I mean, I've got this that's one mana. Oh, up to two creature cards. Yeah. Okay. See, well, at least, yeah, I think I've lost this. No, that wouldn't work as a trade. I mean, I blocked the damage. Right. Right, let's just turn you into a zero. Well, a one three as it stands. Yeah, there's not really much I can do here. I think. Oh, yeah, they'll let that through. Because I'm pretty much out of options. Because they can do. Well. They can't necessarily kill me next turn, but I'm so close that there's really not much else I can do. Ba ba ba. Okay. So I can you block you. You block you. And... Oh, your sorcery. <sighs> yep. That's a loss. That's a loss. So my 1-1 one, one now. Yeah, one one. Do 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 do. That's a tune by Brian Eno called One One. Right, well. Maybe my curve's too high, maybe that's what's going on here. But you you are nice if I can only Uh, yeah. That's okay. As, as, if I can get like a land in the next couple of turns. Discard a card. Uh... Let's get rid of you. Okay. So. I'm on track. I'm on track. Now, if they bring out something, which hopefully they'll bring out, like, yep, that's good, that works out. Yeah, and I can stun you. And what do you turn into? Creatures you control get plus one, plus one. Okay. Discard a card. I think the temporal cleansing. I don't think I'm going to be wanting to send those those. What is it? Those rat rogs, back into their hand. Right. Okay. Okay. And I'll uh, make x equal three. So that's all right. 
Oh, swamp cycling? Oh, they're quite low on lands, aren't they? Ah, oh, okay. I must have had a really bad hand then. So I'm at least 2-3, at least. I'm currently 2-1. Right. Ready versus biggest diggers. <laughs> okay, if you say so. Yeah, that's okay. For a two land hand, that's okay. Right, go in with the order. So, planes first, core halberd. And the next turn, I'll bring you out. Then I'll probably equip the thing. Or should I? Uh. Plus one plus one in vigilance. Yeah, let's uh, let's do this. Are you gonna trade? I'm okay the way to be honest. Okay. Okay, and if I get a land, I'm going to bounce that, I think. I could stun it. But I think I'll bounce it. If I need a land, that's not a land. Even still. Right, they're going to sacrifice that, I think. Oh no. Well, that's okay. You're a double striker. I can equip some potentially good things on. Oh, you're a big thing with a lot of words. That's the thing, isn't it? Some things they just they just have lots of words. Choose one. Each player creates a treasure token. Was that each player sacrifices a creature? Right. Yeah, just because you're big and expensive, I think. So you're going to have to spend your mana to get it back out again. Yeah. Um, nothing I can do. Yeah, all right. Sometimes, like, well, sometimes, plenty of times, the opponent brings something out and I'm just like, well, that's a big scary thing. And I say that not because I know what it is, but because it makes a big, like, a loud, like, noise and it's got a lot of words on or, has, you know. <laughs> anyway, 2-2. Two, two. Last few games have been pretty quick. In fact, this whole draft has been quick. I mean, I'm only like 40 minutes in and I'm on game five. I'm against Dash. Comma. Dot, dot, comma. Mm. Yeah. I'm not going to get much out of that, am I? Okay. I can get some more out of you. Now, do I get rid of a planes? I think I should get rid of a planes.
Right. Okay. This seems okay. Again, a big thing makes a big, a big noise. That's gonna kill that, isn't it? I don't know what the words say, but I know that that I know it's a thing that kills. It, it looks it's 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 red. It's nasty. It's making lightning effects. They're looking at my card. Therefore, that means they're gonna kill it. A flying trample. Oh, that thing. Whenever a dragon you control attacks, it deals two damage to each tag, to to any target. Wow. Not nice. Not nice at all. Well, at least I can attack with you and then convoke because you've got the vigilance. Uh, well, I will attack anyway. If they don't block it. If they do block it, I'll angelic intervention it. Probably. If they don't, I'll use it to convoke. Okay. Are you sure about that? No? Okay. Oh, I can't convoke. Still don't have enough. Well, I can bring you in. You can do a bit of protection. Stop this thing from from breaking out. That would be nice. Unless they've got some other burn effect. Oh, menace. So yeah, that's gonna... Right, now I could... No. I'm just gonna double it. Hold on. Yeah. Um. Tell you what. Let's uh, let's go for this, and if they're gonna block something, I'm gonna angelic intervention. Because angelic intervention will kill that big, a big thing. I mean, the one of them's tapped, so I won't be able to block it because of the menace. But it's still might if if they let it through. Ah, okay. Now do I angelic intervention that one to save it? Ah I guess a one one counter. Oh. Yeah, okay. Um, oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Right. Okay, okay. Uh, it doesn't matter, but they're red, so I'll just pick red. Okay, and then I can transform the incubator next turn if they attack that, which they probably will. And it's a big 4-4 four, four scary thing. I can't block it. Yeah. Go on. 
tell you what, just because I'll forget. I know I could bluff, but I'd probably forget, to be honest. Boom! And now, big scary dragon, flying trample. Two damage to any target. Okay, now what they're gonna? Ah, just gonna just gonna kill that straight off. All right then. Well. Gonna let that in. Right. Okay. Now I can block that and survive, but you know. The they're in they're in black red. They could have all sorts of stuff going on to ch to turn the tide on that. I've got a little um What's it? Um, a dental floss thing. I'm like clicking open and closed. But it re it's requiring some thought from them. Oh, well, they could attack and then do two damage to the thing, and then, yeah, then I won't be able to effectively block it. So they could just attack straight up. But they're just going to attack me? For four. Okay. Yeah, you're a bit of a nuisance, aren't you? Oh, for goodness sake. Come on. Don't give me lands. Right. No, they can let that through. At least when my thing dies, I'll incubate three, which will which will effectively make it a f um, a four four thanks to my enchantment. I mean, they can transform it, and start drawing cards. Not that the cards is an issue for them. Oh man, if. If I got that battle next turn that I made that allowed me to make knights, that would be wonderful. Okay, so they're just going to do two damage to me, probably. And that means they're going to do ten damage to me. That's not nice. That's not nice. Yeah, so they can potentially kill me next turn. Is there anything I can have that can save me? I mean, I have one. I think I have one. That battle that lets me draw, that lets me gain life and draw a card. I think. Right. Okay. So I'll keep you down. And I can attack in the air. I mean, it buys me a bit of time. But you know, I've only got an island in my hand. Yes, yeah, so it's a fine game. I mean, if I... I could draw so I don't know what's in their hand, obviously, but... There is a chance that I could draw something and it would turn the tides of this in my favour. But then also, of course, obviously, there's a chance that I just draw another land. That could obviously happen.
But hopefully they've got like four mountains in their hand. <laughs> or like a zero mana, you lose the game. <laughs> uh, P.S. If this is in your hand, you must cast it. <laughs> But no. Oh, they're going to try and sneak in that last bit of damage through that, probably. I imagine. I mean, is there anything? I mean, if I could get that like, car halberd, um, that can. I mean, it gives me flying, and well, it gives it vigilance at least. I mean that maybe could help but at this point in the game I, I honestly don't know right well um so that has to be right so they'll have some thing in the hand probably Because that's just going to die otherwise. Are they worried about what I've got in my hand? Because if that just dies and my two guys survive. Which they didn't. But I don't get to I don't get an incubator. I don't get an incubator because did it exile it? What was it? Oh, then was that the wrong one? Am I mixing it up? Yeah, I am. Um. Okay, yeah, I've lost. I've lost. I just have to hope that they're an idiot. That is my hope. But. That is a. An unlikely scenario. I mean I'm going to. I mean you know I've got. From their perspective I could have something in my hand. That would. Uh, allow me to plough through. They might feel the need to keep their defences up. By not attacking and all that. Oh, first strike. Oh. I mean, if they attack with everything, they've definitely won. But of course, they could choose not to. Oh, but they are. Oh, well, that just does two damage, so... Yeah. Uh... Yeah. Okay. Two, three. I think my uh, my good streak with this set has sort of waned a bit. I mean, I did have I don't know. I just I started off. Um, I had some really good events early on, but um, no. But two wins. Let's get the prize. Two hundred and two. 200 gems and two packs. Oh, my ears just popped. That's weird. Okay. Uh, anyway, I'm going to end this here and uh, open up my curtains. <laughs> so thank you for watching. I'll see you all next time. Bye.